Good morning guys, what's up? Welcome back to another vlog. When you guys are seeing this, today is Friday per my new upload schedule. Let me know what you guys think of it, if it helps you like get a better idea of what I'm posting. If you like me having an upload schedule, let me know what your feedback is. Yesterday was a somebody drop, so we are going to be packing orders like all day today. It's gonna be a super busy day. And I also had my hair lightened again. If you guys follow me on social media, then you already saw it. But I went for another hair appointment, had it lightened again still working towards getting even lighter but you know i told you guys we have to do it in baby steps but each time i go it is getting lighter and lighter and i'm really really happy with how it looks in case i don't already tell you guys enough thank you so much to everyone who shopped the drop yesterday i have so many orders to fulfill and it makes me so happy that you guys are shopping the store so if you're new here i figured i'll show you guys a little behind the scenes of how i package and ship my orders for my website so i do it a little differently each time and i try to make it make more sense every time I do it so I don't have any space so I do have to package orders on the floor but these are all of the sunglasses boxes so if someone orders just a pair of sunglasses I will ship it in these boxes which Chad and I pre-prepped the other night this is my Rolo label printer which prints out thermal shipping labels and then over here I've got my thank you stickers and then these little sun bunny stickers and here is all of my packaging supplies so I've got some heavier duty tissue paper to wrap anything that could potentially get damaged I've got large poly mailers extra large poly mailers and then this is extra standard size tissue paper so that I can fold and nicely wrap all of the clothing over here is a small quantity of some of the accessories just so that I have them on hand this is filled up with little thank you gifts to include with the orders and then I've got some bubble mailers for phone cases and like some little accessories over here I have two USPS bins so that I can put the packages in I also pulled these out of the closet these are all of the crossbody bags that I'm selling this drop I know a lot of you guys order them so I figured I'll just take them all out now and that way I can just throw them in with your orders and make it quicker here's a bunch of the clothes from this drop I have extras of all of these in my closet over there but it just makes it easier by having a few of each size out already and then same thing over here I just pulled out a few of each of the items so that way when I'm packaging they're readily accessible and then whenever I run out of these I'll just restock it so I don't have to keep running back and forth to the closet now we put my music on lately I've been listening to focus flow we get started break from packing orders Chad just got home and he brought us Moe's for lunch so I'm gonna eat my burrito and have a little break because I've been packing orders for hours just dropped off the packages and I have so much more to pack but at least I dropped off the first batch so I want to show you guys my newest pair of shoes that I just ordered online they came in today 
Um, you guys know my most favorite pair of shoes ever that I always wear to run and go to the gym are my Adidas Cloud Foam sneakers. They're like literally my most worn pair of shoes and I've had them for so long. They're in like a black and gray color. So I ordered a pair in straight white and they are just so freaking pretty. The cloud foam is just super comfortable. They're very form fitting to your foot and they're also pretty lightweight. And I just love how white shoes look, but the goal for these is to only wear them when I go to the gym. I told you guys I'm trying to get back into going to the actual gym, but I wanna keep these white for as long as possible. So I am only gonna wear them to the gym. But yeah, here's what they look like. I'll link them below. They are like such a good shoe to have. Cold brew time. I'm like really overwhelmed right now by how many orders I need to pack so I took a really long break after lunch and now Chad and I just made some cold brew and he's gonna come and help me pack orders because it goes by so much faster when he just sits at the computer desk and goes through the orders prints the invoice and the shipping label and then just tells me like what I need to grab like oh grab an aria top and a medium and then I just grab it and pack it all and he does like the printing of the labels and stuff it just makes things so much faster. So he's gonna help me get through the rest of these orders. My office is a literal disaster right now. I decided I wanted to take some flat lay images, so I like got this out, and then I have this white board underneath that I was also using, and I just like literally destroy the whole office. Good morning, guys, what's up? It's the next day, obviously, and I didn't vlog anything else last night because not really anything else happened, so I just figured I would extend this vlog into today. Um, I already have my hair and makeup done because I went and shot some content this morning for Instagram and also for the store and I have all of these orders that I have to take to the post office. Luckily with the second half of orders from this drop, Chad helped me package all of these so it went super fast last night. I got all of this done but now I have to take it to the post office on my own so it's probably going to be like three trips. Okay, so I just dropped off my packages and those will all go out today because they did not come to pick up yet. So thankfully those are all gonna go out today, which makes me feel so good because doing the drop on Wednesday allowed me to get the orders out the same week. Whereas typically if it, the drop is on Friday, they don't go out until Saturday. And if it's after their pickup time, they really don't like, even though I take them to the post office, they don't like start getting mailed until Monday sometimes. And I hate that for you guys. Cause I try so hard to have a quick turnover time because I know what it's like when you order something online and you want it right away. Um, so it just feels so good. Like, okay, they're gonna go out today. All of my orders are all caught up. I don't want to, but I'm gonna go get my nails done because these nails, it's not quite time for me to go yet, but they are just so terrible, guys. Like, they're so thick, bumpy, and they just, they look awful. <laughs> it's way later now. I just woke up from an unplanned nap. I did go and get my nails done and they look absolutely amazing. I went back to my classic white and I decided to get them long just cause like I miss having claws. I know that I'm going to probably get tired of this and want to go short the next time, but I really like them. I just did long white coffin nails and I went to a different salon obviously than the place that I went to last time who did a terrible job. Um, I went to this place is actually really close to where I live. So I'm really glad that they did such a good job because it's like, I'd rather go there because they're closer to where I live. But anyway, yeah, I took an unplanned and very long nap because I got home from getting my nails done. Actually, while I was at the nail salon, my stomach was hurting so bad and I do not know why. Like I was bloated and I was just like having a lot of pain like in the upper part of my stomach. I feel better now. I don't know if it was something I ate or what it could have been, but I was having like really bad stomach pain. So I just came home and got in my bed with my heating pad and passed out. And now it's six o'clock and <sighs> And I'm gonna make us dinner. I got a super exciting package in from UGG, you guys. This is probably my most exciting collaboration. I'm gonna be working with them on a styling video coming up soon and I seriously can't wait. I love this brand, I've always loved this brand. And for the few cold months in Florida, I can't wait to wear all of this stuff.
Chad came home thankfully and decided to cook the chicken so I didn't have to cut up the raw meat because I don't like touching raw meat. Don't judge me, but I just don't. I will if I have to, but he was like almost home. So he did the chicken, I did the broccoli. And we're also going to make some of this Annie's shells and real age cheddar macaroni. I love Annie's mac and cheese, it's so good. Dun 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 Don't judge me, I'm eating on a paper plate. I know that paper plates are not great, but I like to not do dishes sometimes. Sue us. Okay guys, I am gonna go ahead and end this vlog right here because I would like to edit and upload it tonight as per my upload schedule. So thank you so much for watching. If you're not already subscribed, be sure to click that subscribe button and I'll see you in my next video.